Hello everybody and welcome back to Alchemy Story where you uh, join me at the end of a dark day. You might find special ingredients at night. Ooh, like dark water. Which one needed dark water? Because I got some dark water. So that was sleepy drink. That was to fall asleep instantly. I need more cherries. Yeah, more cherries. I didn't think cherries would be the thing I'd be running out of. But it's a daytime day again. Yay! So we can uh, open up all these garden slots. Thank you for fixing the garden, Arabella. Uh, I'll feed you hazelnuts and maple leaves. Maybe a cherry. I don't know if that's everything. Um, looks like it is. I would like to completely clear out the garden. We've got like three more spaces. We nearly have enough money to do it. So another garden bed, another snack for me. Another hazelnut, I think. Nom nom nom. Lavender, chamomile, lavender. Lavender, chamomile, lavender, pumpkins. I think cherries might turn into pumpkins. I'm not sure though. I definitely think there's a a uh, correlation between them. I just haven't looked closely enough at what's happening. So, so if I clear this to expand my garden, right, and I feed a maple leaf, what's growing? on that new patch. Chamomile. So I think maple turns to chamomile. I think cherries turn to pumpkins. Um, yeah, lavender turns to chamomile. Cherries turn to pumpkins. Now, can I get into my inventory here? I can see all the ingredients I've got. So what potions do I have? I have five fertilizer potions here. So if I want my pumpkins to grow, for example. What do I have not very much of? I could do with all of it, really. So if I drink that on top of this, they'll instantly grow. Just so I can show you guys how this works. I need to go feed Ellie some more. So I want to feed Ellie some um, pump, some sorry cherries, and I want to see if pumpkins grow. So let's see. Pumpkins are growing, yeah. So it seems like cherries turn into pumpkins. And then I want to try and feed a hazelnut, and I want to see if that turns into lavender. Lo and behold, it's lavender. So depending on what I want depends on what I have to feed Ellie. Let's get some more money. We've got one more slot that I can uh, that I can fill up there. Oh, well water as well. I, I must not forget that. To grab all the cherries. Cherries and hazelnuts are the way forward. And maple leaves. All the things off the trees help my garden. But I'm not seeing any hazelnuts or any... Uh, Maple leaves or cherries today. We're having a bad day for tree growing, I guess. Oh, here we are. Three hay... No, four. It looks to me like you get bigger and bigger as time goes on, or I'm not sure. Or as you expand your garden, maybe. I know in Garden Paws, the more you expanded your kind of home base, the more... Um, the more things grew in the wild. So I wonder whether this has kind of got a, a similar base to it in that way. I mean, that only had two on it. It might just be random. I need to go and feed my animals. I don't even know if I did that yesterday. I'm really bad at remembering to do things like that. So it's a case of if you want something off your animals, you need to feed them. 
And they seem to to be quite happy with the things that grow in your garden. So lavender, chamomile and pumpkin, for example. Fill up the tray with stuff. Go and see what we can make in the way of potions. make one dash elixir can't make kitty drink at the moment i'm pretty sure that's because i don't have i can't make fertilizer potion because i don't have eggs i can make some sleepy drink no i can't because i don't have cherries triple brew i don't have enough hazelnuts i don't think so we need a few more trees and stuff a bit more gathering needs to be done i think Okay, well, I got a little bit of money there, 290, so I'm going to just try and save up now for my cow. The more food you give, the more items that the animals might produce. Okay. We only got an egg today, and I wonder if that's because they're unhappy that I missed a day of feeding. Pumpkin, chamomile, lavender. The animal will be well fed today. Interesting. Yeah, so I think that that matters. I think uh, the fact that it's two days in a row of feeding means that they're well fed. Could just get that last patch, but I don't, I think... I think really what I want to do is make sure... Oh, we've got hazelnuts and things today, yes. I think what we really want to do is just make sure that we get the cow today, if nothing else. Because that's the one thing I want to show you guys. It's the one little bit of the gameplay mechanics that I haven't shown you. An egg in the eggplant. Oh, I've got loads more stuff today. Yay! Hazelnut on that tree as well. Head round here. So yeah, we've got a good hour's worth. Probably an hour, hour and a half's worth of gameplay at the moment. Uh, I imagine this is very early build. It's nice that the early build plays nicely though. I, I would rather have a game that plays nicely and then adds the features in. The only bug I found so far was the one right at the beginning where I was running and uh, it wouldn't stop. But like I say, just bringing up a menu sorted that, so that I don't mind if it's a bug that you can sort easily. If it, was, if it made the game unplayable, that would have been a real shame. But luckily it didn't. Yeah, let's see what we can make. In fact, yeah, the garden's not ready at all. Make some triple brew. Can make some sleepy drink. Make some more sleepy. No, we can't. We don't have enough dark water. Make some fertilizer potion times two. Times two? Yes. Kitty drink we can't make. Dash elixir. We don't have shiny water, but I don't think I've drawn from the well today thinking about it. Let's go and quickly do that. That'll allow me to make some of that. So that might be enough money if I. I'm lucky to get the cow today. If not, I'll definitely have it tomorrow. Okay, back we go. I want to try out a few of the potions as well. I want to try like the dash elixir. I tried the fertilizer potion and that was quite useful. Wow, sleepy drink is a huge amount of money. Probably because you have to wait for the dark water. Well, that'll definitely get me my first cow. Woo! Hello! Oh, you're so cute! Oh, what a cute cow! Oh my goodness. The adorableness is just off the charts. 
And they just wander around the barnyard. Oh, so cute. It's so, so cute. Okay, animals are being fed. Garden has been sorted. Everything has been gathered. That looks like the end of the day to me. And then we'll see if we can get the kitty ears. Drink a dash, Alex, here to run faster for the whole day. Wow. So this is something I want to do if I can. I've got one dash, Alexia. I'm going to drink it and see how much faster we run. A bit faster. Not, not a huge amount faster. But it is faster. So that makes my gathering for the day a lot quicker. And it lasts the whole day. That's nice. So you don't have to be kind of like... I, you know, it's not like 30 seconds and then it wears off or anything like that. It does last the whole day, which is quite nice. Especially when a large part of the game is the fact that you're running around gathering things. Maple leaf over there by the looks of it. And then I'll see what's going on. My gardens look amazing right now. Cool. I've got a butterfly there as well. Gonna expand that one out. Now you need lots and lots and lots of food. Garden is full. Cool. And we've got all nine things planted. Yay! Let's go and have a look at the animals. Butterfly there, chamomile, lavender. So the cow left me some milk. I imagine that uh, eventually the cow is going to leave me some fur as well if I keep feeding them properly. So let's go feed them. Okay, so the animals will be well fed today. There's a chance I might get some fur. And when I get some fur, that will mean that I can uh, make that kitty potion, which would be pretty cool. Got some triple brew there. That's enough for another chicken. It'd be rude not to. So I need another thousand gold to completely finish all of the content here. I think we could do that. But yeah, I do think this is like a quite solid um, base mechanic she's got going. And I think what she said is that um, it'll be like more characterization Oh, you could do with, uh... yeah, it'll be more characterization. It'll be more um, kind of putting in things like NPCs and people to give you quests, all that sort of thing. That will be what will be coming next. Because the base mechanic of how you make money and things like that is great. It's a really, really clever idea, but I think what what is needed now is expansion. So bigger garden, more different plants, more different potions. Um, and then, as I say, different people, the different places you can explore, all that sort of thing. It's a very, very small world at the moment, but I think it's, it's got quite a lot of charm to it as well. Dash potion. And like I say, it generally seems to play quite nicely. It uh, seems quite smooth. Art style is beautiful.
Okay, another day, another dollar. The more food you give your animals, the more they might produce. Look at the garden today. We've got a butterfly out here, but no growth. Except those pumpkins over there. They have grown. Wonderful. I mean, it looks like there's more things you can feed Ellie. It looks like there's a good uh, four or five different things that you're going to be able to feed Ellie eventually. So we'll have to see about that. Garden is full. So I just replanted the pumpkins, basically. I'll have a look and see if we've got any fur yet. Got milk. And egg and fur. Yes, we got fur today. And egg and feathers. Very nicely done. So give them another little feed of... Uh, Pumpkin, chamomile, and lavender. Seems to work quite well. And we can make kitty potion. I think I want to. I want to keep my kitty potion though. Brew it, kitty drink. I want to use my kitty potion. I mean, once I get enough for another one, then I won't want to use it. But I definitely want to use it now. Kitty Drake! Kitty ears! Look at me with my kitty ears. Oh yes, Arabella, you look beautiful. Okay, so... What can we sell today is the question. Lots of sleepy drink apparently. Unfortunately, sleepy drink requires dark water and I can only get that on a dark day, so... I don't think I can make any more of that, no. Dash Alex here again, I keep forgetting the well. Every day I forget to draw water out of the well until I brew my potions and then I'm like, oh, hang on, I could make Dash Alex here if I had some water. And then I go get some. Uh, Dash Alexia. But I can't sell any more potions today, so time to go to sleep. Yeah, I've already worked out the uh, the idea behind Ellie and, and the growing the seeds. So, actually, I can't brew anymore, I've realised. Let's go and see what the owl wants today. Kitty drink, Dash Alexia, and more kitty drink. Well, I have Dash Alexia already. If I can get some fur and stuff. Egg and feather. Just an egg. Milk. Any fur? Is it maybe fur every second day? That's alright though. You don't have to give me fur every single day. will be well fed today yay just gonna pick whatever we can up from around the place check on the garden I've not had dash alexia today do i have dash alexia no so that's fine i probably sold it we'll just have to be slow today i imagine that as you kind of build up uh, all of the ingredients in the game. You'll start to use things like Dash Alexia a bit more. And then save ingredients for other potions. So imagine once other potions are added as well, you'll just sell other potions and not sell your Dash. That's what I would do anyway. But at the moment, I'm not so worried about that. Boop. Boop. like the garden is chockers. Yay! I like that butterflies sometimes grow in the beds as well. That's quite a nice touch. I have to feed Ellie lots today. 
Probably stand just in the right place, it gets everything. So one, two, three, four, five, six things. Hello, Ellie. Is that a snack for you? Yes. Snacks. I think that's a full garden now. Yeah, there we go. Wonderful work, Ellie. Do I spy maple leaves over here? Yes. Oh, good grief. There's loads of stuff everywhere, actually. There's an egg. I definitely think I can get the rest of the chickens and the cow within the next kind of 10, 15 minutes. So I think I will carry on until I've done everything I can do. It's so cute though. Sometimes you get multiples by the looks of it as well. Did you see that? Like when I was picking a hazelnut, I was getting more than one. I don't know whether that's um, meant to happen or, or what there, but it seems like it's becoming a lot more bountiful as the game progresses. So I have already fed the animals. Drawn water from the well? Probably not. You know what I'm like. Okay, so we've got more shiny water. Let's go and see what you want today. Kitty drink, loads of kitty drink. Let's see if I can make any kitty drink. I don't think I got any fur today though. That kind of sucks. Yeah, I didn't get any fur and I only got one milk as well, so. I need the other cow. I think if I get the other cow quickly, then that'll be, that'll be cool. So day 12, first moon. Ah, if this is another dark day, we'll quickly go and get water out of the well then. Dark days are good. And my pumpkins have grown. I wonder if they only grow on a dark day. I'm not sure. Many cherries on the tree today. That's really cool. Let's see what we can sell as well. Let's see if we can get another cow. I think there's a good chance we'll get another cow today. Triple brew and dash. I need a dash elixir. I might be able to make one actually. Lovely, so we've got 655. That should be enough to buy another cow. The other cow, I'm only allowed. Oh, right, I can only do that in the daytime. I'll have to do that tomorrow then. That's fine. Let's go see what else I can find. But I do not think it will be long before the rest of the cows and uh, the rest of the chickens are unlocked. I want to see how much a kitty potion sells for as well. I know with all the others. Kitty potion, I think, is the, the only one I haven't sold yet. Because I've only just been able to unlock it. Get all these maple leaves. I'll go harvest the pumpkins. And then we shall go to sleep. I notice the music's come back now. I'm gonna have to have a look, good look through the recording and see where there isn't isn't music. Pumpkins! Ellie is afraid of the dark. She won't come out. Poor Ellie. I've got the dark water already. Just wanted to double check that. I'm guessing that my animals are all gonna sleep on a dark day as well. So. 
Dog days are good for getting dark water, but other than that, they're pretty pants because you can't plant anything, manage gardens, or do anything with your animals. Zeppy Moon. Sleepy drink will get you home in the blink of an eye. I don't have any triple blue, triple brew or dash elixir, and I need those. So for triple brew, probably have the stuff for it and get some shiny water because I always need that for dash. So you can only ever have one dash potion per bright day, so you're not going to have dash potion every day, no matter what you do. Unless you can build another well. I mean, that might be quite cool. Brew dash potion. Brew... Fertilizer potion. Brew sleepy drink. Brew triple brew. Quite a few of those. I've never actually worked out what triple brew does. Triple the growth of an ingredient found in the wild. What? So that could be like cherry trees and stuff. Teleport home, fall asleep instantly. I've used Dash Alexia, I've used Kitty Drink. Triple Brew I have not used. Interesting. So let's see how that works. So I should have been using triple brew on all these things. Okay, so if I use potion, triple brew. It won't let me drink it, okay. Interesting, okay. Well, I've got these hazelnuts here, right? Oh, I didn't mean to grab them. Okay, let's go over to another tree. So say, oh, that's got just a butterfly on it. I need to just try and work it out, you see. Did I forget to feed the animals? Yes, I did. Because it was a dark day and I didn't go to collect off them, I forgot to feed. I need to remember on dark days that I have to feed them. It still says I'll be well fed, so I might get decent stuff tomorrow. I'll get a kitty potion tomorrow, definitely. Right, so triple potion. Nope. Okay. Nope. I'm really not sure how that works. Won't let me drink it. Okay, I would. I'm just gonna say that's one thing that I, out of pretty much everything in the game so far, that's the one thing that I have not worked out how to do. I could try it in my house. Whether it's not in yet or whether. There's something that I needed to do that I haven't managed to do. Try it in my garden. If I need to be like literally stood on camera while. Let's try that. Ah, here we go. Okay, so if you stand on some chamomile or some lavender, literally stand on them and drink triple potion. It'll work. It doesn't seem, but the looks of it, to work on trees. Okay. 
So once you've got your garden, it's not so good. You need to feed Ellie. Maple, maple, hazelnut, hazelnut. Cherry, cherry. Hazelnut. Cherry. Hazelnut. Hazelnut. Oh, there we are. All done. Wonderful. All right. I'll buy another cow today. And probably some chickens, actually. I got everything. I got a thousand. Okay, I said I needed a thousand to, to get everything. So I think we're nearly done. Hatch a cow egg. Hatch a chicken egg. Hatch another chicken egg. So all of the animals unlocked. That's all the money I need. So the only thing that I want to know now, I'm going to keep sleeping until I can do it, is how much a kitty potion goes for. So I'm going to keep feeding these animals until I can get a kitty potion and until he wants a kitty potion. Doesn't want one every day, just doesn't want one today. I need to get the fur and the milk together. Got some fur and milk, lovely stuff. Eggs and feathers. Eggs and feathers. Butterflies and hazelnuts. So yeah, I'm not gonna go around gathering too much today. I've worked out how pretty much everything works now. I'm gonna make myself a kitty drink. And then I'm gonna see how much it sells for. It's the hardest to make potions, so I imagine it should sell for the most. So we'll just keep going until the owl basically wants a kitty potion. You want a kitty potion today? Yes, you do. So let's ship it. 455. That's really good. So that's if you can make a kitty potion, that's almost enough to buy another cow, which is amazing. So I think with that... I've unlocked all the animals, I've unlocked all the garden slots, I've unlocked all the potions, I've worked out how to make them all. I've worked out how to use them all, I think. Let me double check. So, Dash Alexia makes you run faster, Kitty Drink gives you Kitty Ears, but Fertilizer Potion fertilizes the crops, we did that. The only thing we haven't used is Sleepy Drink. Let's see how that works. Get back to bed in the blink of an eye. So there we are. That's every single potion made, used, sold, worked out how much it costs, all the animals unlocked and all of the gardens unlocked. So what a cute little game. Really, really sweet. A really, really, really lovely start. Really nice base mechanics and a really interesting idea. Um, so at the moment, we've only got about an hour's worth of gameplay here, but I can see lots of scope for expansion just depending on the kind of work that goes into it so i'll be keeping an eye so i hope you enjoyed and if you did then please do leave me a like below i will see you all soon but in the meantime please look after yourselves and keep being awesome